Hi YouTube, what's up? Um, we are starting a new series today called Until Dawn. I have had so many requests for this, um, and it's finally happening. I'm very excited. There's my girl Hayden Panettiere. I love her. This is a star-studded cast. I'm very excited. Um, so yeah, I don't know much. I don't. I don't know anything at all about this game. Just that it's scary and it's another story game. So I'm very excited. All right, if you enjoy this, please thumbs up. This series will... Hey, all right, here. Here's my official announcement. This will be just like Life is Strange. So new episodes of this will be on YouTube every Tuesday over on Ricky Dillon Extra. And I'll be playing new episodes on Twitch live on Thursdays starting next week. I'm about to go out of town. But okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's get into it. All right. Um, let me actually make sure... Oh. I was going to do subtitles. The butterfly effect. Oh, good. Okay. Let me do... Let me make sure subtitles are on. There we go. Okay. There. All right! The butterfly effect. Yeah, Jordan Fisher's in this. The mean girl in Camp Rock, Megan Megan Martin, I think. It's a it's a fun cast. I'm ready. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds. Your story is one of many possibilities. Choose your actions carefully. Okay. Maybe I will. Wait. Sorry to pause again. I want to go into performance mode. Just so things don't lag. Okay. We should be good to go now. Alright. So a spooky snowy house. You guys, how is the volume? Can you hear me good? Can you Oh what the Hayden Panettiere. Volume's good. Okay. Just let me know if I should adjust it, okay? So what is going on? Hannah! <laughs> me. They play hide and seek? She's here. Game volume seems low. It. Sorry, I keep pausing. We'll have to work out a couple of kinks since episode one. So, volume's a little low, you guys said. Let me upload it. I mean, upload it. Raise it a little bit. All right, let me know how this is. Okay. Oh, I can move. Okay. These gloves are nice and fun, but they're a little hot, so I gotta take them off, and I can't really control that well. Okay. 
So do I play as this girl? This is fun. Alright, well let's get the hang of this. I'm glad I can use my controller. Let me learn all the all the controls here. What does this do? Nothing. Oh. What? Oh. Wake up! Yeah, the visuals are nice. I like this. Hello? Um. Oh, what just happened? Oh. Beth. Current objective, find out what the others are up to. Okay. Whoa. Look at all this. So she likes Hannah and Josh a lot. Okay. Ooh, she could be a little bit funnier. We'll work on that. Okay. So, just find out what the others are up to. Got it. They're sleeping. Oh, okay. Um, oh, okay. What's up here? Oh. I thought that was stairs. It's a door. Alright, what's everyone up to? Y'all want to take a shot? Looks like you had too much. Use the tutorial. Use the right stick to look around. Objects that glint can be inspected. Oh! A bottle! Press and hold R2 to pick up the bottle. Oh, wrong R. Okay. We got a bottle. Okay. Jeremiah Crag. Cool. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. Um. Okay. Hmm. Oh. 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 Okay. A note. Hannah, you look so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest room at 2 a.m. Mike. Ooh. Oh my God. Naive sister, get herself into now. Oh. Oh. I got your note. Glad you can make it. Oh my God, he is handsome. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out, and see where it goes from there. But he already seems like a creep, to be honest. Wait, what? Why what? are they? Oh my god! What the? Matt, what are you doing here? Yeah, oh, what's going on? Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. It's all got out of hand. Just a stupid prank. Uh, hey, you what? Guys are jerks. Yeah, you Hannah. sure are. Hannah. That was mean. <gasps> what? I feel overwhelmed. There's so much going on. Um, I'm gonna wake Josh. Oh, making decision. Oh, that was my first choice. Josh. Josh. Fuck. Guys, there's someone outside. Oh, the killer. What the hell? Hannah. What's going on? Where's my sister going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Hannah. That was a mean prank. What did you do? We just messed around, Beth. It wasn't serious. Yeah, I was. Shark. Yeah. Hannah. Hannah. So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Oh, 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 oh! This is timered. Okay. Oh my god. 
Um, we, we should be safe. I'm gonna be safe here. Oh my god. Hannah! Follow footprints. Oh, how cute! Have you guys seen my friend? Use the touchpad. Whoa! I just slid that open. That was fun. Hannah. Okay. Oh, okay. Hannah. I feel bad for Hannah. That was so mean of all of them. At least Hayden Payne and Sierra wasn't being mean. Her name was Sam, right? What? Oh my god, that scared me. Oh, I can walk fast. I'm marching. Hannah. Hello? Hannah Montana. Hello? Ooh, let's, let's inspect this. Oh, I keep pushing the wrong button. Uh, what? Huh? Death totem? What? What did I just see? I gotta watch that again. What now? Oh. Okay. Well, that was weird. Hannah! Can you perform Nobody's Perfect? I won't tell anybody your secret. Hannah. Oh, my camera was covering up. That was a death totem. Sorry about that. Okay. Hannah. Ah! Why is there fire in the middle of the woods? Okay. Hannah. Hannah. Oh, Hannah. we found her. I thought she was going to be dead. Hannah. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here, take my coat. I'm such an idiot. Oh my god. What's going on? Oh my god. Y'all better run. Uh oh. Thank God. What is that, a dragon? Hold on. Ah! What is what's going on? What? Huh? I'm letting go. Oh. 
Oh god. Oh! Well... They died. The analyst, okay. That was intense. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you Jeez. understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. Huh. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I All right, thank you, you, Raven. Remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. Okay. I am sweating in this costume, not so, only. You have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Who is this man? Sometimes. Sometimes these things can be a little scary. Even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find. Yeah, he looks so real. Through. It's kind of creepy. Hmm? All right, we will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up the card? No. And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. No. It, it is essential. You answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Why do you sound drunk? He's like slurring his words. Creepy. Why am I wearing a glove? Am I the killer? Uh, okay. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Neither. I'm gonna put uneasy though. Okay, honesty is good. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? You. I don't trust him, y'all. I'm not sure. If it is something you can't see, then why does it make you feel uneasy? I mean, is there something in the house? I don't know. You tell me. Huh. So, if it's not in the house, then where do you think it is? Can it be in the field? Sure. And is this threat human or is there some other fear what? you have that you would like to talk to me about? I, this is silly. I don't know what I'm doing right now. Um, I'm going to say it's human. So you think there's a person in this field that is a threat to you? That's quite intriguing. Ah, oh, well, perhaps we can explore your fears a bit further in our next session, I'm afraid. We've run out of time. This is weird. Oh, it's still a little, um, quiet? Should I raise the volume, y'all? I wonder why this game's so much quieter than usual. No, it's good? Well, that was weird. Oh, wow. Those two girls died before the title screen. Yikes. For them. Do y'all hear this song? Oh, death. Raise the volume? Okay. All right. I can raise it a little bit. I should lower it, let me know.
a bug. This song is haunting. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Oh. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. It's been a year. Thanks for having me, Marty. There's an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. Oh, they were twins. The Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. That's so sad. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Anthony. Oh, that's so sad. Washington's tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary oh God, of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. How sad. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you, and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget. Oh, those are his sisters? Or, oh. For the sake of my sisters and oh how sad you know okay so let's party like we're fucking porn stars okay make this one trip right. we'll never forget all right okay yes woohoo so who was that that scary killer it's been a year i wonder what happened I like the song. He tried to save them, not kill them. I mean, he was breathing fire and creeping around and chasing us. I don't know about that. Episode 1, Memento Mori. Ten hours until dawn. Okay. Oh! Is it that guy again? Sam, Hannah's best friend. Diligent, considerate, adventurous. Thank you, Lena, for subscribing. I appreciate that. All right, I do. Oh. I gotta protect Sam at all costs. I love Hayden Painting Tier. I cannot see her die. Oh. 
Oh, okay. A note. Oh, what? The gate's busted. <sighs> climb over, Chris. Okay. How do we climb? Oh, over here? I'm gonna be safe. We're not in a rush. I gotta protect her. Oh. Jeez. Oh my god. This keeps you on your feet. Hello? I hear you. Yeah, the breathing? No, thank you. Aww. Hey, little fella. When the don't, don't move icon is... Don't move. <laughs> oh my god. I don't like that. Okay, we did it. Okay. Well, let's see what my objective is. Head to the cable car station. Ooh, we're not really that close with any of them. We're charitable, we're brave, we're not that funny or romantic. Yikes. We're pretty honest. That's good. Okay. Okie dokie. Let's go party! What's this? Oh. <laughs> cool. Whoa. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believe that butterflies carry dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Death! Black butterflies prophesize the dreamer's death. Danger. Red butterflies warned of dangerous events. Loss. Brown butterflies foretold of tragedy affecting friends. Are any of them happy? Okay, yeah. Guidance. Yellow butterflies offered visions of the help and guide. And fortune is white butterflies brought dreams of luck and good fortune. So, okay. Good to know. Uh-oh. Not one of these again. Oh, so picking a totem up and turning it will reveal a colored butterfly and a premonition of a f possible future? So we saw a vision before, and then it happened. Okay. Okay. That was a guidance totem. Cool! I'm into this. Little that's a raven action. Okay. Whoa, that's pretty up there. Where do we go? Is this where we're supposed to go? Chris? Oh. You here? Chris. Let me in. I said, let me in. Okay. Um. Bags here. What are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Who is watching us? Hello. What do we have here? I'm gonna snoop. Ashley. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Chris. Oh, that scared me. Has a crush on Ashley. 
Methodical, protective, and humorous. Okay, we like a funny guy. Hi, Chris. You scared me. I, I'm sorry. Are, are you my secretary? In fact, I am. I was buzzing. Cool. Well, thanks for letting me know. I, I can take it from here. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. Yeah, right. I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on. It's this way. Where? Right around here. It's going to blow your mind. Okay. Thank you, Taylor, for the 100 bits. And I'm glad you like my costumes. Thank you. I love the sound of boots marching in snow. Crunch, crunch. What is this? Oh, oh, clue found. Wanted poster. Nice. Milgram Victor. America's most wanted. Looks like someone thought so. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Wait, huh. Up here? Wanted in connection with the first degree arson offense, as well as various death threats. There was someone shooting fire at us. But 1998? What, what? It's definitely been a while because they have iPhones. Okay. Noted. Oh. So we want to collect clues. Okay. Alright. Ta da! What? Red, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What are we looking at? What the hell is a shooting range? A shooting range. At the base of a ski lodge. Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's oh, dad? Put that yeah. gun down. He's, he's like Grizzly Adams or something. That's not gonna try. Uh, now you go ahead, Grizzly. That's all right. That's sussy. Here goes. What? What are we doing here? Oh. All right. I'm gonna shoot this. Oh, oops, wrong button. Well, let's look at him anyway. All right, Chris. So he he likes Ashley and Josh a lot. He's curious, funny, ch and charitable. Not very brave. Got it. Okay. Um, take this. Why isn't it working? Take that. Oh, over here. There we go. Okay. Take this. A little bit, little bit of this. And some of that. Wow, I'm good. Wow, nice shooting ticks. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, nah, I don't think so, girl. A little bit of that. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh, I don't want to... I'm not shooting that if I have to. I'm not shooting a squirrel. Nope. What? That's actually a choice? Uh-uh. 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 Nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. I'm not shooting the squirrel. Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Yeah. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Put the gun down. Yay, the squirrel's alive. All right. Wait, I really like... Coming back up here after a whole year. I really like how you can you play as all the characters. All came flooding back. That's cool. Here goes fast. And why is there a gun just sitting there? Definitely a little weird. Yeah. 
Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. So, where do we go? What's my task? Go to the cable car. The path is beyond our control. Okay. Is it over here? No. Can we break in? Let me in. Oh. He had a key the whole time. For you. Oh, real gentleman. My mustache is itchy. All right. And I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. We're walking in it's circles. Beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like. Sleeping giant. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh, shut up. Oh. Thank you, Ginger Girl, for the 100 bits, and that is very important. I did notice that. My relationship with Chris went down because you snooped in his phone. Keep that stuff in mind. Well, he can get over it. Finally. You coming? Yeah, well, I was going to stay here and catch some Z's, but... Enter car. All right. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Here we go. Well, that's what I just said. Adventure begins. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. Yeah, I'm getting weird vibes Josh from Chris. Really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, kind of the worst. Thank you, Shelby, no, for no, subscribing. It was, it was Happy good. nine months. I love you. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Good. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. What? So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Huh. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off the train bra. Uh, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Interesting. Right now. Or we're talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Okay. Oh, Jess, Mike's new girlfriend, confident, trusting. <laughs> I thought that said irrelevant at first. <laughs> Jess, confident, trusting, and irrelevant. Got it. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people, time to meet and greet. Hi, Christina. All right. 
I want to look at her her info. This is fun. Jess. Okay, so she likes Matt and Mike a lot. She's honest, funny, romantic. Everything's pretty decent except she's not charitable. So she's irrelevant and doesn't like charity work. Got it. Oh, she's Megan Martin. She's in Camp Rock. I like her. I'm too cruel for you. Okay, where... Where do I go? Oh my god! What the hell? Jess! Hey! Jessica! Over Jeez. here! Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? No. Pretty please? I'm too cool for you. Oh my god. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey, Chris. <laughs> I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class kind of annoying. Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Um. What should I say? Give that back. Give that back. Give that back, you tool. Tool and die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosing around in other people's nostrils. It's funny because we were uh, looking through his phone. Yeah, I, I try not to do that <laughs> as a rule. Come on, Jess. You can tell us. You can totally keep secrets. Whatever. You'll figure it out eventually. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just going to wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? <laughs> I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam? <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Yeah, right? He Seriously, got... couldn't they have built the lodge like right where the cable car ends? Emily, Mike's ex. Intelligent, resourceful, and persuasive. I love these little character intros. This is fun. Okay. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend. Motivated, ambitious, active. All right, gotta be honest. I, I kind of can't keep up with everyone so far. There's a lot of names I remember, but I'm sure I'll get it. No. Jordan and Fisher. The bell boy when you need one. Okay. Let's see what he's like. Matt. All right. So he likes Emily and Jess a lot. Ooh, he's not funny or brave, but he's honest, charitable, romantic, and curious. Okay. Good to know. Chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, uh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. I mean, what do you think? Oh, oh my gosh! Oh! Jesus! <laughs> Jeez, they actually have real jump scares on this. <laughs> Mike, Emily's ex. Intelligent, driven, persuasive. God, that actually got, <laughs> that got me. <laughs> you got it. So Michael. wait, you really, really should have seen your face. So they, dude, I their exes, and they're dating. Now. Nice one, Michael. You're a jerk. Cool guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Welcome to woods, it's spooky. Come on, <laughs> let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. 
We're all friends here. I'll be nice. Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Nah. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make <laughs> out. Uh, no, seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Okay. Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. That's really sussy. Can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. That's fine. All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. Huh. What is she up to? Oh. oh. Ashley. Has a crush on Chris. Really? The annoying guy? Academic, inquisitive, and fortright. Bunch of big words there. I want to read about her. Okay, Ashley. She likes Chris a lot. Everyone else is kind of similar. She's very curious. Pretty honest, pretty charitable. Not very funny, brave, or romantic. Oh, what are we... She is... She is curious. What are we looking for here? Oh! Now, what is that? Uh, what am I supposed to find? Oh! Oh! oh whoa! Somebody's getting a little friendly. They're <gasps> not in the friend zone kind of way. Their exes. They might need to check the expiration date on their big break. Uh huh. Well, she's definitely curious. Thank you, Ryan, for extending your sub through November. I appreciate that. Oh my God! <laughs> God. Hey, whoa! <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to. Jeez. Did you what? what? Did mean to. Scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real. So you got me. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Hey, well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, oh. Let me check it out. Uh, ooh. Shoot, what am I... I'm gonna encourage take a look. He should see what's going on. Um, sure, uh, go, go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh. oh! Son of a bitch! Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yes. Yeah. Uh. ever just nothing with him? Ooh. Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Uh-oh. Matt. Drama. I'm too cool for you. Let's check our phone. Oh! oh! You did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? 
What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Ooh, let's throw a snowball back at him. Take this! Oh. I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> take that! Oh! <laughs> Great. Hey, you know that? <laughs> This is flirty. Where are you hiding, little chicken? Oh, oh, jeez. Oh. Take that! Oh, ah! Hey! Oh, snap! You missed! A bird! <laughs> Hello! Come on! Take this! Hey, Mike! Boom! Shakalaka! Okay. Okay. <laughs> Something doing nothing is the right thing to do. Hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. I'm not shooting that bird. Sorry. But I will be throwing it at him. Whoa! Oh. Right. And then what? Oh, no more. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right. All right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? You're a worthy opponent. Miss Jessica, the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Um, let's call, let's kiss him. Let's have some romance in this. <laughs> wow, save some for later, buddy. Endless reserves. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was <laughs> making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Oh, not this guy again. Hello again. No. And how are we feeling? Hmm? I felt that we made some good progress. He bugs me. In the last session. No. But I'm grown concerned about your situation. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Okay. <laughs> Men worry me and women worry me. Um, I'll do men. Oh. Hmm. I'm gonna say crowds. I fear heights, I fear drowning. I definitely fear heights. I were. I can swim pretty well. Oof. Definitely snakes. Okay. Oh. Guns are way scarier than knives. S snakes still trumps 
bugs. <laughs> yeah, where's the both answer, honestly? Oh my god! Clowns or scarecrows? Well, I ha I was a clown the other day. I'm gonna put clowns. Gore disgusts me. Crows are scary. I guess gore. I don't. Crows are fine. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Did I startle you? You did. So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Yeah, right. Ugh, now here's the ultimate both. These are very close, but I think snakes is a little bit more. Hmm. These are like different but similar. I don't really fear needles. I faint my blood is taken, but I'm not scared of it. Very interesting. Oh. I do not do well with zombie stuff. I cannot handle it. So that's definitely that. <laughs> I fear dogs. I definitely don't fear dogs. I love storms. Okay. This is very interesting. Thank you. Thank you for answering so. You're welcome. Diligent. <laughs> Snakes, zombies, and awful. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> he is creepy. Uh, oh, oh, oh. I bet he's a color. Well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time. I bet he's bad. I promise. We'll talk again very soon. I think I need a new therapist. I'm not so sure about this one. Previously. Do we finish the chapter? Did you guys think this is a little bit? Oh, oh. Come on, she deserves it. Hannah, what's going on? Where's my sister going? It was just a prank, Han. Wait, was that the end of the? Wait, was that the end of the chapter? Remember him from Prison Break? The therapist is in Prison Break. I don't remember him actually. All right, I'll do one more. I'm I'm gonna typically just do one episode, um, per stream. But since I'm gonna, since I'm gonna be gone next week or this week or whatever, I'm going to New York on Wednesday for a week. So I'll, I'll keep playing. No! First off, I gotta say I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Wait. I forgot I have to be up really early tomorrow and I still have to edit tonight. So I think I actually need to stop here. I know that was kind of short, but I don't know if I can do a whole other episode. Thank you, Smelly Cat, for subscribing. Happy two months. Yeah, I think I, I, need, I need to be smart and cut it there, you guys. I have to be up really early. Or there's an AC guy coming. Okay. So that was episode one. Thank you for watching YouTube. Thumbs up. Um, like I said, every Tuesday there'll be new episodes. Um, 
and I'll be playing live every Thursday starting next week. So I'm about to go to New York. But that was fun. I liked this so far. Initial thoughts. I think it's really fun how um, you can play as all the characters that jumps around. I like that. Um, I'm definitely hooked. I love the fun little jump scares.